Hey guys, welcome to Prey. Uh, I've never played this game before. Um, I've heard a little bit about it. I got it on a sale not too long ago. Uh, it's just a normal. I have no idea how hard it's going to be, but... Um, dude or chick? Um, let's go dude. So the only thing I know about this game is it's something to do with aliens. Um, I think they're like mimics. Yeah, they can basically take on the form of other things, so there's probably going to be some jump scares, I reckon. That's why I put the camera on. It's been a while anyway, hello. <laughs> um, you wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. Wouldn't put it past me. Oh, press any button. Okay. <laughs> Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Was that for? Hey, Morgan, wake up. You're burning daylight. You said the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Neural mode application instructions. Hmm. Okay. Oh, listen. Uh, Really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. What? Don't know if I get anything from reading everything, but... Pizza. Enter password. Got free email. Congrats, so glad to hear you'll be coming aboard soon. Your first official work day is Monday, March 15th. What day was it again? I can't remember. Uh, okay. Sent a package, first day, uniform transcribe and a neural mod. Store uh, the neural mod right away. Follow instructions. This is from Alex Yu. Hey, I just got off the phone with mom and dad. They won't be there. The shop departs. They're in New York. Company stuff. Um, okay. Take it, Alex is my sister or brother. I don't want to claim. <laughs> Hands on electronics. Okay. Um, I want to fuck around first before I put my uniform on. So it's kind of like Deus Ex where there's just random books everywhere. Don't know if I'm actually going to learn anything from them. The picture. Oh, it's the person that was on the call with me. Is that me on the top right? I can take the sparkling wine. To note, congrats, Morgan and Alex. Thanks, I guess. Um, pomegranate and green tea. At least it tells you what what's in things, instead of like opening a separate uh, window. I like that. Tomato jerky. I think I've wasted enough time. <laughs> some uniform. Is this going to be like Half-Life? Morning, Mr. Yu. Hello. Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. Okay. Huh. Space to jump, shift to sprint, seat to crouch, or slide while sprint. Okay. Even have a pilot. 
Mr. Yu, please make yeah. yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transtar facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. Must be a big job if I uh, get my own private helicopter picking me up. Graphics seem quite cool. Here we are, Mr. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Kind of want to jump into the rotor blades just to see if that's a thing. <laughs> I won't. Hello, Dr. Yu. Oh. Robot? I'm a civil 495 science class operator. It won't be long before you're on a shuttle bound for Talos 1. My instruments are calibrated for high volume data analysis and live reading. Don't worry, nothing will be missed. Our research often requires intense focus and long hours. I can provide you with a psychoactive stimulant after the test, if necessary. Everyone's eager to see what you're capable of, Dr. Yu. I know I am. Weird. Welcome, Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Morgan! Finally! Yo. Uh, we're just gonna stand here awkward? <laughs> hey! You don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy is going to walk you through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. Okay. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Listen, just be yourself. I'll see you after. Why is it so messy back here? Dr. Yu. You clean up the place. Good morning, Morgan. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Oh, this Probably is fucking kind creepy. Of you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All <laughs> good? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Okay. Weird. Go, 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 go. Wow. That went. Wonderful. That's. You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B then. Okay, take the box. This takes the box. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time, relax, think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. But then I'm, I can just think about it before pressing the button. Right, I take it if I hide here or not, because there's glass. So Morgan, basically. We can see you there. <laughs> Hello. Am I hidden? <laughs> Synaptic register at all? No? No, that's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. Okay. I mean, you didn't really give me much to hide behind, so I probably looked like an arse. Oh, I could have brought the boxes through and made a wall. All right. Here we go. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible, without thinking. 
to just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simmons? I installed exactly what Tina brought down. Did you double check? Speaker's still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. Good. One last room. Let's step into D. That seems suspicious. <laughs> Don't know why I'm taking the chair with me. You gonna open the door or what? Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Um, let's go somewhere familiar. Ah, good. Looks like you got the hang of it. Keep going. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does that make you feel? Uh, angry. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. Yeah. <laughs> A runaway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there's one person tied to the second track. Um, yeah, switch tracks, because then one person is easier to save than Good. five, I guess. Next. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man pushing him onto the track would stop the train. I, uh, can, I, can it guarantee that? Uh, I don't think so. Almost done. A runaway train is bearing down on five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Push the fat man. <laughs> uh, nah, well, save five people. I'm going to say I. I don't know if I would in real life. That's just say my character would. <laughs> wow. I'm impressed. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. In a moment, I'm going to ask the you fuck? what... Uh, is my coffee? It's empty. Oh. oh my god! Security! Security! Shit. <laughs> Why the fuck did they gas me? <laughs> Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive, sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. First weird Good test. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Wait, is that the same day? Oh, is it got a groundhog day me? Is this the same? Yeah. I think I'm being groundhog dead. Same emails, I guess. Not more emails. Danger leave now. Ooh, this is creepy. It's always spam. <laughs> what the fuck am I pressing here? Uh, hmm. Let's change then. That's the same. Get all my stuff again. I think that was it. Eh? Was there anything in the bathroom? Hmm. 
Okay. Just a dream. Why do I keep hearing a weird noise? Oh, that's why. Shit. Total flashlight. Got a wrench. Ugh. Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What <laughs> happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, first, you need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. Um, so I take it that's the same woman. She's just a weird fucking alien or something. Escape from your apartment. Mm hmm. Oh, that looks like a fucking door. That's a closet. I never noticed this before. Mm, no secret passages. Oh sweet, I nearly missed some loot. Uh, yeah, tell me how. I have to go out the window. There's like a landing. Oh. Shit. Fucking watching me in my apartment. So where the fuck? I mean, I flew. Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the... Exit. I'll keep in contact. Smash all the mugs. Okay, so I need this for something. A helicopter ride looking glass sequence should only be reset in the overlooking control room. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Ah. Do not open door while simulation is in progress. Make sure I've not missed any loot. Oh shit. Uh, swing your wrench, press and hold to charge your attack. Is it telling me this because I'm about to get attacked? Uh, what the fuck is that? Safe code is a jewel. Password ICOP O eight seven six. Do not write down password. Hmm. Not sure if that tells me anything.
guy's really loud. Tilly's. I'm just pressing anything. Sweet medkit. Oh, crap. Jesus, fuck. Typing cacoplasmus. Everyone calls them mimics. Be careful what you pick up. Um, I think I just need to smack it. Let's throw a chair at it. Hello? What's it doing? Stands out like a person. <laughs> Die!